All right, I'm back for another part of Event Zero. Continue where we left off. Which, if I recall correctly, was somewhere in the garden trying to figure out how to hack a probe. Had me an idea. Um, last part, I was kind of probing around the AI, you know, giving it some weird questions here and there just feeling out what its responses were like um i think this time i might take another look there and um see if i can probe a little bit um of the ai as a computer system see what commands are available to me maybe i can um find personnel files or um something for the two crew members that I know about, which are Nandy and Anel. You can restore your oxygen supply by going back inside and pressurizing the airlock. Well, that's... That's, uh... One way to do it, I guess. And when in doubt, ask Kaizen85, which I have found to be something... Uh, a bit less useful. <laughs> at times. You need a keyboard to play Event Zero. Yes, I agree. You do need a keyboard to play Event Zero. I don't think this would be effective on console. I mean, unless you had a keyboard on your console. Kaizen understands commands, but it understands complete sentences better. We've seen that one before, but now I'm starting to believe that it's not necessarily true. It seems like Kaizen, uh, Kaizen is very much uh, reliant on certain keywords being present in those sentences which is not exactly sentence recognition. All right, and we're back here in D13. Just a quick peek, see if maybe there's something that I definitely missed last time. I mean, I do know that there's a door back here. I can see it, but I can't get to it, so. All right, let's take another look at this console and let's let's look at it this time like as a system here let's see what, what was the last thing i did elevator um can i ls i'm not your personal computer oh well it doesn't seem to like that list commands that's what i'm trying to figure out um who am I? Um, C. Oh, okay. Oops. Show logs. Okay, well done, the This This enumerates the most recent events. Oh, okay. Um,. File missing, date missing. Oh, and uh, also I was taking a look and trying to get the timeline together here. So Anel, according to Kaizen, says that uh, he lost touch with her in 2005 when she died, which was 18 years after the voyage began. The problem with that is the interface we saw at the beginning said that the date of departure was uh, was at uh, 0845 on 4487, and 2520 days had elapsed, which is not <laughs> enough time. Uh, that puts the current date, according to at least that interface, at February 26th, 1994. So, something's not adding up here. How long do these entries go to? They go to 1990. So, can I, uh, can I actually open a file missing? I'm guessing not. No. Entry 2. Crew 1. We don't have a name. Blinds closed. 1988. Lines open, lines code, uh, watering system enabled, okay. Elevator moving down, elevator door open. Now, this might be useful because I, I want to know what Nandy knew, right? 
she she was already doing calculations and stuff for breaking the window so clearly she was on the same path as me there's some reason she didn't complete that mission um i can't believe something um she was on to something but for some reason never completed her mission to break the window it seems Data corrupted file missing i'm gonna try it anyway mine's closed just gonna try oops there's a log in each terminal of the spacecraft So I have to go back to the other terminals to get all the logs. Now, where was I? I that up. It's open. No water is okay. Bedroom door unlocked. Bedroom door open. Bedroom door closed. Bedroom door unlocked. Terminal garden. Has anything is recognized? Login. Read successfully. NL profiler SH. Terminal garden entering the reset mode. All right. So it looks like uh, May 4th, 1989 is when NL set up a profile. NL. You know, come out, please. We need to talk. It's crew one, crew two. What is it? I think I've figured it out. Go on. I've been talking to him. I believe it's not lying to us. Technically, it cannot lie. It is not making sense, though. Destroying the drive. It is not dangerous. I've run the numbers 1,000 times out of paper at this point. We have been here... Something such a long time that I think we would have figured out. Um, can't be destroyed. I refuse. Are you trying to force me to commit suicide with you? Well, I'm trying to hack our synthetic friend here. Keep doing that. In the meantime, I've changed the bridge password. You did what? Are you saying something? No, I'm not. You are going to regret this, Nandy. You know me. This is. Okay. ITS. Going home. We'll see uh, about that, presumably. Okay. I'm just going to skip the file missing because clearly they, they don't have anything. Uh, excuse me. User erased. Guys, where can I find more paper? I'm out of paper, so that must be Nandy, because she said that she was running out of paper. I'm here to help user erased. Who are the helpful AI of the ship? Yada yada, where are the stationary? As far as I know, all available stationary supplies are kept inside the passengers' cabins. Are there are none left in mind, any more paper from my calculations? May I suggest that you try using other services for your personal writing? Cave woman in space. Fabulous. Okay, user erase memorizes B2, E3, F3. You are the bow. Terminal garden entering reset bow. There you are. What is it, Anel? What is this probe doing inside? I think Kaizen broke this one for some reason. It might be trying to compromise the Nautilus to get rid of the drive. I don't think we need to rule this out. I know we disagreed about the drive, but you can't risk the Nautilus, Nandy. Yes. I just go outside and check the antennas. You do it. I'm busy, Nandy. I need to figure out what happened with this probe. Also, Anel was the one who was tinkering with the probe. And you're just sitting there chatting with the AI. 
three F three. I don't know what that represents. It is valid hexadecimal. Same file missing. Uh, no. And okay. Well, that's not great news. Um, that was February seventh, nineteen ninety. Whatever that code does seems to force some kind of reset mode, perhaps, or something. Um, anyway, that's not great news, because I was hoping that that would tell me something about what they know, but now I see that all of the terminals have logs on them, which is rather tedious, because that means I'm going to have to go back, but that's okay. I don't really have much else to do right now. Um... Okay, what? Okay, where? What requires my attention? Well, that's thoroughly unhelpful. Commands. Well, I, that I've already figured out. Um, oh. Uh, how about dir? All right, D11 is open. Let me try that one and see if there's actually, like, useful logs on them, or... or... Lots of file missing. Here we go. Um... Open D10, please. Okay, Nandy, depressurizing. See you on the other side. Thank you, KZ. Welcome, partner. Alright, this is... 2790... I think Nandi might have died on that day. That's it. Okay. But they were different logs, so now I have to see... Let's check back upstairs then, because there's a ton of terminals up there that I didn't check. I need to know how to control one of these probes, or... Something. E2, E3, F3 is the only real lead I've got right now. Alright, that one's useless. I might as well go back to the beginning if I have to do them all. Like, to the very beginning, even. I wonder if there's anything... What are you doing? <sighs> oh. 
open. Two, please. Unlock D2. Show logs. Okay. January is before the flight took off, so over there. Come on, boys. We don't have all day. What do they need? Four chairs. So it only took off with two of them? Oops. I don't know what might happen. Nothing will happen, Nandy. What about... Or what do you think about that Robinson Syndrome poster? It won't help as much as the AI. That's why there's an AI in the first place. Isn't it too dumb to help? Its mental faculties are not the point. It just has to seem vaguely human. That's enough. Sure, looks Mikey. I guess they took the press photos from another angle. It doesn't kill us during the takeoff. A little afraid of that thing. Okay. One horizon, my ass. That's it. That's none of that is useful. I can't go back out there. The address doesn't contain a log file. What does it contain, I wonder? a text file. I retrieved the human. <laughs> All right. I retrieved the human. that. Ugh. Oh, it's this thing. Please. 
Stay put, Kaizen. Just keep the Nautilus there until further notice. Okay. And I know that there's a terminal in there, but I'm going to continue down here. Get the ones in the corridor first. Analog system, okay. Okay. Uh, in the bathroom, this is personal. Hey, this password is important, Andy, I know. I'll put it under my pillow or something, make sure you don't lose it. In fact, you shouldn't have written it down. It's just four digits. Forget things, me too. Take the diary to your room, but be careful, okay. Right. <laughs> Eisen, you need to open this door. This is post retinal scanner. D5, damn it. Profiler SH, very well. Warning memory access protocols were written a lot. Into cleanup failed. Is it you? E2, E3, e, uh, F3 could be a memory address. Like I said, it's valid hexadecimal here. Oh, Nandy. What are you? What are all the wires for? It's just leaving. I'm trying to see whether the Kaizen unit downstairs is the same as the one here. But of course, it's the same. It sits on the same mainframe. I had to see for myself. I'll get back to my work downstairs. Hey, do you have any paper left? Self, sorry, all these supplies, but not nearly enough stationery, huh? Well, I mean, you guys used so much paper. All right, who's who here? Andy was looking for, or concerned about paper before, but... So crew two is Nandy. So, or um, crew two is Anel. Crew one is Nandy, which means that Na uh, Anel was the one who was tampering with the door. Also, can't help but notice that there's no log entries for any of my activity. Um, somebody came in on uh, February, uh, so, uh, February 7th, 1990. Same thing. Under the pillow. So that would be when Anel took the diary from her. Brought it back to her own room. I wonder if this... Oh, so we do have entries going into the 2000s here, 2010, 2011. But there's not much to show for it. Interesting. I won't obviously have a chance to do show logs on the computer in there anymore. I'm pretty sure that's completely busted. Which I kind of wish that I had known about um, this before. Because apparently I won't ever be able to get back to that one. And probably the one in the airlock as well. But it is what it is. Open D7, you'll have to enter the password. Nandy has changed it. I have the password, guys, and open D7 now. Okay, this will require your undivided attention. Maybe a three. Digital code entered correct. On. During reset mode. Whatever it is. So, Anel did get into the bridge. And apparently has a three in it. So one of the four digits is a three. And that's the only entry. Okay. Um... The only terminals I haven't accessed yet, I should say the only terminal I haven't accessed yet, is the one in the living room. So 
Oven activated, light switch, okay. What do you mean the map is erased? This makes what map? Now we're talking about a map? I'm telling you it keeps repeating it. If you tried hacking its speech patterns, it doesn't budge, it says it wants to save us. This makes no sense. You know, and also it's getting really you mean cranky. It's a excuse me, not guessing a fucking machine. Uh what I can. God's sake, I'll try it myself. She did say that the units are the same, so maybe we can hack. Maybe we can hack the door downstairs somehow. I am water. Singularity drive. We're closed. The hell is Nandy? Let's switch to activated. Nandy, where are you? Hey, what's going on? Why is your notebook in the fridge? I thought I'd put it there. Some, I thought I'd put it somewhere safe. Uh huh. The bridge password is on the cover. This is the worst anti security I have ever seen in my life. You won't go all curt on me now, will you? I'm guessing you're referring to Kurt Taylor, the as we learned in the prologue, the president of ITS. Uh, I'm taking it with me. No, you're not. Put it in the bedroom. Damn it. Maybe it ended up back in the fridge. Maybe I'll go take a look there. Corrupted. Wine, okay. Piano connected, piano database updated. Piano database. Oh. What's auto play mode? Oh. There are notes. Is B2. So 3, D3. There's E3. So Q, R. Haunting tune. I'm, I'm guessing T was um, F3. So it was Q, R, T. Oh shit, I didn't see what it said. Unlocking what? Oh, unlocking probe manual. Okay. What do I have to do? What? I don't under. Uh... Oh.
Not sure I entirely understand what this game is. Am I trying to do a whole, like, blackout here? I'm assuming that's what this is. I'm creeping up on my alert level awful fast, though. Oops. Hit the wrong button there. Hope that doesn't screw me over. It's getting close. Damn it. I think I screwed myself over with that mistake I made. Again, if you're if you are familiar with this game and you're watching this, it might be driving you crazy to see me stumble through it. But I am not familiar with this game. I have never played anything like it before. I'm just assuming what I have to do. And honestly, even if I did know what I was doing, I probably wouldn't be particularly good at it. So cut me some slack. We did much better this time than last time. So all right, we did it. Antennas have been set to manual mode, activating antenna terminal success. If the terminals outside the ship could result in a missed whatever the last bit was. And here are the coordinates of Mrs. Johnson's room, HT3034DF. <sighs> Okay. I'm gonna check by the fridge anyway. It's jammed. Content is Metropolis, we can see that. Alright, so it sounds like I'm going back outside. I wonder if it's worth trying the. Probably not. I'm just gonna go back down. Small talk while the elevator is running, apparently. Um, tired of this relationship. Oh, 
I'm pissed off the AI. Oops. I pissed off the AI. That's probably not a good move. It was only a matter of time, though. Let's be honest. We have a bunch of way markers now. A couple of antenna relays, I think, and then the window itself. And I forgot to write down. Oh, well, hopefully it gives me the reminder, though. It's pretty good about reminding me about important information. So. All right, then. Antenna relay up here. There's actually one over here that's probably closer. Sure. Okay, I think I have to stop it at the right point. Not sure if it's one at a time. I'm also not sure how to stop it. Pushing buttons doesn't seem to be doing anything. I mean, there's zero, one, two, three, four, five. Pressing zero doesn't do anything. Um. Oh, okay, I have to press the key when it's in the thing. Oh, but uh, uh, we have to do this at the right time because the T is not locked in. There was a T in the in the other position as well, and I locked them both in, so we got it though. The coordinates changing probe routine. It's that guy right here, right? Seems to be on target. It smashed. I need to do that again. That's not enough. Oh, once is not enough. We gotta do it again. That's why we have multiple waypoints here. Uh, oh, there's one down there. But uh, now we're closer to this one, so.
Hey, okay, I'm here. Oh, happened again. Okay, that one didn't work. So it does not take enough. Uh-huh. Okay, we'll do this one now too. I should have enough air for all this. I'm not too worried about it. Seems to be glitching out. There we go, we got her. Zoom back up here, and there we go. I saw a gas venting, I see the probe hovering up. So what do we have here? that hit over there. Saw something. Thought I saw something. Oh. Over there. I need to open the bathroom. Or I should say, I need to get the AI to open the bathroom. Oh, unsurprising. Yes, we biological organisms and are constantly to relieve ourselves. It's disgusting, frankly. Try and get there before I run out of air. Um, there. Okay. Let's get the hell back into the ship before we die.
guy is really pissing me off. <laughs> but I'm sorry. That's an amount of time. And then he opens it. Oh, God. <laughs> this AI is uh, pissing me off now. <laughs> uh, we, were, we were doing fine working together, but uh, not anymore. I think those days are over. Now on, it's every AI for themselves. All right. Got it right back over here where we were. Problem with the AI is that it holds a grudge. It will not cooperate if it senses that I have been less than cooperative myself, but it is also misinterpreting the things I'm saying as being less than cooperative because I have been nothing but cooperative. So, but I recall before engine made my space travel. So, yes, the uh, computer can sense when it has leverage of some kind and it's absolutely willing to take advantage of the situation. It's less than ideal, but it also thinks that a good working relationship is... I have to make sure that I am making nice nice with the AI at all times. Pressurize SH requires a password, eh? for the bridge. Oh, 
Yeah, the AI, I got on the AI's bad side because it was like, it wouldn't let me out. So I was like, just let me out, it'll be fine. But then it was like, you don't care about me. Mostly I've had relationships with very similar dynamics. Didn't work out so good then either, so... And uh, that will be it for today. We will get to the bridge in uh, the next part. I'm having a lot of fun. I'm enjoying this a lot. So take care. See you then.